to those places to get their hair done, to get their nails yep. done, get their hair cut, whatever. You There's don't see none of that cars stuff in Sherwood. There's none of that stuff. You here. don't see. I mean, you don't. But they set it up that way. Black people won't come. I, dating. I hate to t- I hate to go on a date and tell somebody where I live. I can cancel that. The first thing coming. Well, I ain't gonna be able to come and see you. Why? Well, it's not that I got any <clears throat> prior or anything. I just, I just ain't trying to be harassed and falling. North I, of the I, can't, river. I can't even argue with that because it's true. Sherwood, they don't like a lot of black people here unless you're in the military. But you better have them tags. Yep. Period. And that's real unfortunate. But I don't know, man. Uh, <clears throat> like I said, anytime you have conflict, it's usually between black and white. Probably because. Most of the races in America ain't that vocal. <laughs> and Black people are all usually always rah rah about who we are. Hence me, but uh, um, hence Chuck. You are absolutely the, the, right. One of the one of the, when you and you say that the, the crazy part about it is, is that do y'all know? Like I said this on on Facebook Live uh, like a couple weeks ago too. Um, <clears throat> we are the only other race of people aside from white Americans. It's Black Americans. That cannot be deported from this country. Man, that shocked the heck out of me when you said that. Like, we can't be deported, cuz. They (laughs) can't send me anywhere. Where we gonna go? Where we gonna go? We here. Like, we from... My mama... My mama is from the south side of Little Rock, Arkansas. Like, they can't send me nowhere but back there. (laughs) You gonna go to Southwest. I'm gonna go to... I'm gonna go to the south side and stand there. That's where my people from. They not from Africa, bro. They from there. Like my dad's people are from the northeast. Like you gonna send me there or you gonna send me there? Sure, but either sure way, well, police was getting ready to send you back to the south side. Hell yeah, <laughs> he's he was trying to send me somewhere. He couldn't yeah, find it. My tag went out of day. Nothing. He couldn't find no reason. I went speeding. Yep. But look, I say that to say this. Like, like we gotta like we really gotta realize. Like don't like I hate like all this talk about. Oh, I'm gonna move to Canada or I'm gonna move to Africa. I'm gonna move to this place. No. This is home, cuz. This is home. Wherever you go, this is home. This is home. Like, they they not sending me from here. I served four years in the military for this motherfucking place. I don't care how fucked up it get. I'm going to keep complaining. I'm going to keep trying to do something because this is my home. Ain't nobody running me up out of here. Nobody. I don't care who. Trump could come himself with the Secret Service. I'll fight every last one of them motherfuckers. And they have to kill me before they get me up out of here. You'll bury my body somewhere. But I'm going to be here. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's no way. Like, so all that talk about, you know what I'm saying, going this place, go that place. No, it's not happening. Africa don't want us back anyway. I mean, shoot. <laughs> they ain't never wanted def- us. That's how we got here. That's how we got here. That's how most of them don't come back. That is how we got here <laughs> is because Africans slave traded. So we're not going back there. We can't go back there. Cancel Christmas. Yeah. It's not happening. For sure. Now, I know this is off the topic. I don't, we didn't even talk about this topic, but... Uh, them dirty-ass plates. No, no, we no, We talked no. about them nasty-ass plates. No, no, playing, no. I, I, I was going <laughs> to ask your opinion about something. On, on a more, uh, a less serious... Well, I don't know. It, it's kind of... It kind of concerns me. So, I got to ask you, Chuck. Like, what is your opinion on this whole Kanye West fiasco? Like, what do you think is going... Like, what's going on with him? Like, what's the deal? What's the deal, Pickle? I mean... <laughs> he done lost... I mean, I I feel like he's losing. I'm not going to say he lost it. Ain't shit going on with Kanye that ain't been so? going on. Nah. To me, I mean, Kanye West been off his rocker. Like... But he's, like, further off now, though. And, and you know why? And, and me and my brother said this a long he time ago. Because was Kardashian, you think? No. It don't got nothing to do with a Kardashian. And that's... That, the crazy part is that that's what people think. Like, I remember... I remember when his mom passed. Yeah. Like me and me and my brother, like we love Kanye. Kanye West is that dude. Oh yeah, man. When I remember oh, yeah. when his mom passed, and the single on the radio, at least in Arkansas, was "Flashing Lights" from the graduation oh, yeah. album. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And the next album that he made was "808s and Heartbreak." Mm-hmm. <clears throat> every interview I saw Kanye West on, every song I heard from him, has been different since that point. He's made some great music though. But and nothing he always like, does. Nothing like before, though. I mean, for me, Kanye is just Kanye. So I think it's the, it's the same either way it goes. I mean, I, I think all of his music has been great. I I, I thought that uh, Black, Black Skinhead or uh, Yeezus was one of one of the greatest albums of all time. Nobody will agree with me, but that's fine. No, nobody's but gonna do that. Kanye West has been different. You you never know how like 
a death like that is going to affect you. Like, you got to understand, that dude was the only child. Like, yeah. all he had was his mama. I got I got a friend right now, you know, uh, we went to Marine Corps together. All he, uh, His family is his mama, you know what I'm saying? Like, and anytime she gets sick, he's like, yeah, man, my mama's sick. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, bro, she just got a cold, but it's my mama, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, you never know how somebody will take that. He ain't been the same since. Yeah, but I, I don't know. He has I, not I, been I, the for same me, since. I think it's a factor. But I don't think it's the root of the issue. Like I, I, for me, that's my opinion. I don't feel like it's the root of it. I think there is definitely something else. I'm not gonna say it's drugs or anything. I'm not gonna pin that on them at all. I just, I, I just can't see that being. Um, I can't see that being it. But it's definitely something going on with dude. Like dude is really. I feel like he done canceled his entire tour. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. But at the same time, and we were talking about the Kardashians, I'm not saying, oh, he married Kim Kardashian, so therefore he got to be crazy. But come on now, Chuck. Now, you got, I mean, now every man that done came up out of one of them vaginas then lost it a little bit. Sure. Bruce Jenner decided to be a whole, a whole woman. Thought he was a whole, think he a whole and woman. And you know what I saw? I saw a young dude talking about that uh, on one of those little things on Facebook, one of the videos. Yeah, I mean, that probably plays a part in it. You know what I'm saying? But, I don't know, man. How would you I, feel about I, having your entire life televised, though? You have no privacy. Well, that's something no. that he chose, too. Like, uh, So, that part right there. Any Anybody that's involved with the Kardashians, whether it be, um, you know, Black China is on there yeah. a, a, she once in a while. Know. She wouldn't She winning. But, uh, who, who was it? Was it Tiger, Tigger, whatever yeah, his Tiger. name is. That, that I don't dude. even know why he got money, but. Kanye West. But, but, but. You involved but, yourself. Lamar Odom. Yeah, you involved he, yourself with Yeah, them. but he let me tell that. you this, though. One thing I can say to Black China's defense. I did watch. I did indulge in their little reality show, right? Um, I guess this what I guess we could kind of tie it in to, to the cast tonight. Okay, so she's with one of the Kardashians, right? Mm -hmm. So. They all feel like, okay, y'all getting married. You know, y'all need to buy a house together, do this, this, and that. And China's like, no, I came from nothing. And I like my own space. I worked hard for this house. I worked hard to pay my bills. I got several businesses. Now is not the right time. Yeah, we had a child together. But at the same time, you're not going to take away my independence. She told him that. Right. She's a black woman. You got Kardashians. They need these black, black men, these black men. But I don't care what nobody say. There is no other race stronger than the black woman no other race stronger than the black woman so everybody in his ear oh try this and try that and so on and so forth and she was like f the blogs i worked hard for this yeah. nobody's gonna take my independence and i can respect her for that like they thought oh she getting with a kardashian for the money like she said i got my own money right we, we my <laughs> net worth is more than his right if anything i need a prenup you know what i'm saying right. so i can definitely appreciate that um, do I think she could have been that for, uh, an African American man? I don't know. Not so much. Cause African American men don't like women that strong and I'm not going to say all of them, but for the most part, we talked about not even for the most part, uh, for the most part, no, 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 no. I think, no, 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 I, think uh -huh. I think today, like I, I don't even see, uh, I think, I don't know. I, I don't think we just, we, we live in an area where people just want to be. Talking to somebody, you know what I'm saying. You think uh, so? This this the talking to area. It's not the getting married or, or dating or nothing like that. It's just the talking to. No area. no 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 no. Don't you mean for black people or for for most people? Because you know white people go ahead and get married. Oh yeah, we were talking about that second. Yeah, you know we were talking about. We need, it. we need to start following that model. We need to talk but, uh, about. I'm talking about for black people. We need to talk about this. We need to talk about. This. I'm talking about for black people. I need to be enlightened because I don't get it. I don't get it either. Why don't Why don't black men marry? I don't know. But see, that's the thing, though. But that's the thing, though. It's funny that you Don't say that. It's so funny me. that you say that because me and some of my black male friends, a couple of them, were just talking. Like black dudes out here, at least in Arkansas, they getting married fast as hell. Are they? Yes, they are. A lot of them. They what get. Is it, though? You get a, a good girl or a girl you think is good, is cute. Three months. Uh -uh. Oh yeah, we engaged, bro. Uh -uh. We finna get married. Goddamn, bro. Uh, well, no, let me ask you this. Sheesh. Okay, if they get married. The woman that they're marrying, is she the only one? I don't know. I don't know their life. Is she, like, I'm going to marry her. Are they faithful, though? 
Anybody can go to the justice of the peace and get a marriage license and sign off on it. But are you committed? Are you, you asking faithful? me a loaded are question? I no, I, it I, is a no, loaded question, so I need a loaded answer. I don't answer. know these men life. No, nah, I'm talking about the people that you know. The people that you know. I don't. I don't know personally. I know we like my homeboy. One of my homeboys is like, yeah, this dude from my hometown, he finna get married. I said, oh, this this dude from from Chicago, he finna get married. I don't know them, those guys personally, but they met somebody, dated them for two or three months, and now they get married. Yahtzee. <laughs> <laughs> I have I just, no I just idea. Don't feel, I, I just don't think, like, statistically, I've looked at that as well. Look up, look up the statistics. Black, black, black people just don't get married like that. We still get married. No, 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 no. Yeah. Not like that. Not like, like, Asian people, uh, that's what you do. Nine times out of ten, who you was in the hospital with, <laughs> that little baby next to you, that's probably who you going to marry. Like, they are brought up to get married and to have families. Hispanic people, they'll move the whole, the whole family in. The grandma, the great-grandma, the uncle, the auntie, everybody moves in, but we all married. The government has destroyed the black family. Man, but, okay. They don't even die. They no, have. No, no, no. They have. Okay, they why, have. why do you say that? Well, I mean, so, like, damn, we only got a few minutes left. Dang, Yo, we should probably. We child should probably. support is a fucking, like, joke. Like, that's a yeah. joke. It's like, like a given. Oh, we like had a baby. I got the put court your system for it. and how it pits black men and women against each other is a fucking joke. I agree. Like the, the, <laughs> I agree. The government's I, I, torn I, I, this I'll apart. Give you that. I'm just gonna say it like that. I I'm not a conspiracy theorist. That's not a conspiracy. That's just the truth. The government's torn the black family apart. Real talk. Nah, I'll, I'll give you that. In in in, uh, in like the 70s and 80s in New York, like <clears throat> if you were a single mother. And, you know, you, you weren't married. You couldn't get government assistance if the father stepped foot in the crib. <laughs> For real? I can't even get none from my woman. <laughs> For real? At her house? Damn. If they found out about it, it was a... Well, that's a different subject for a different day man yeah, it really is because that because because the government is torn the family apart the government did it no the black man did it i don't agree i do 100 percent. so how about we do this how before we end this how about okay listeners for the next episode you do your research and i'll do mine i got you you say the government ruined the black family, right? Mm-hmm. I say the black man ruined the black family. The government ruined the fucking black man too. Okay, so next episode, I mean, please all, tune in. Over. Next episode, we got to talk about this because it's over right Chuck, there. Chuck, he's not thinking straight right now. He didn't eat when we went to dinner. That's what it is. I ate so. plenty today. <laughs> I'm well fed and I'm woke the fuck up. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Hit the plug. Look, Hit the they plug. T- they telling me the time almost up. I didn't uh, ask you where the time was up, goddammit. Okay, check this out. Yeah. So you're listening to Mike Chuck 1212. <laughs> <laughs> you're listening to <laughs> Jody underscore L O three E. That is my Snapchat. That is my Instagram, which I very rarely post on. Uh my Facebook, Joel Denise D N I E S how did my mama spell it? D N E I S E. Yeah. Joel Denise on Facebook. She just asked how, how her mama spelled the job. You know what? Because it took me a minute to figure it out. My <clears> auntie <throat> had to tell me. See, the black man destroyed the family. Follow me on Instagram. <laughs> Lord underscore Charles underscore first. Follow me on Snapchat. Mike Chuck 1212. Follow me on Twitter. Loud Pack McQuack. Or friend me on Facebook. Charles Michael Young. And we out this bitch. Ha.